Hello there, welcome back to part two of my Battlefront videos. Um, I'm actually having to redub this video because for some reason my mic recording got corrupted while recording Battlefront 2. Curse of Battlefront strikes again. Um, it, it's not good. The multiplayer as of recording is absolutely awful. My god, it does not work at all. Going by my recordings, I jumped into like the first game was on Mustafar. Um, you can't choose what size you're on, it's just auto assign, which is really annoying. Um, especially if you want to play with your friends, because you can't pick what teams you're on. It runs fine, I, like 60 FPS. People were complaining, I don't know if that was just like PC side, that it was only running at 30 FPS on Battlefront 2 multiplayer. Um, it seems to be fully 60 on Xbox anyway. The amount of lag that online has for BF2 is insane. Like, after time, I don't think my shots registered at all. Felt like I wasn't hitting anyone, like, at all. Um, I think I maybe got like two or, two or three kills throughout my playthrough. There's also this weird issue with when when you die and you respawn, like, the screen just violently shakes. Like, it's trying to determine where you are on the map. Like, it's really weird. It gave, at one point, it, it was so bad, it like, gave me a headache. I'll show you a clip now, and just, just look at, what what is this? Oh man, it's just horrible to look at. <laughs> oh. With my second match on Magito, it, um, it was over so quickly. I felt like I was in the game for maybe a minute and a half, possibly two minutes max, and it, it just ends because for some reason the spawn ticket for either side is only 100, which makes no sense whatsoever when you consider, was it 32 versus 32? So 64 players. It got, it's done, it drains. Even before you've captured the command post, it's like halfway down, it feels like. I just, I, I started getting into the match, started getting the hang of things, and over. There was one point I was doing so well, I got to choose to be a hero finally, Kiaudi Mundi. I was like, yes, I've been waiting for this for ages, decimate some players online with my boy Kiaudi. Um, three sec, two seconds maximum I got to play with him before the, the round ended, and that was it. <laughs> sort of dampened my spirits a little bit. So here's the part coming up soon where I get to play as Kaldi. I join, you obviously you die, you choose your trooper, you wait eight seconds, five seconds to join back into the match. By the time I joined back in, I jumped and the game was over. Now that's not really necessarily the game's fault, but it's just the fact that the game was over so fast, I, just, I didn't get a chance to do it. A minute and a half and th that match was done. A minute and a half, that's... It's, it makes no sense. It makes no sense. Considering this one is the most popular of the two games, you think this would have been maybe the priority to get this working? You know, it might be fixed after recording. This was recorded a day or two after, um, and I haven't played again since. Maybe there's a patch. Maybe they're working on the patch. I don't know. Hopefully, but it's totally. It's just. It's unplayable. They need to fix the ticket rate. They need to fit because the matches, are like I've, I've said, the matches are so fast. Come on, please fix this. I've, I love Battlefront 2. I never really got a chance to play the online on PC because of my like my PC has always been pretty bad, and I'm not really a PC player. I'm more of a console player, as are millions of others who have been waiting for this day for a long time because the original servers got taken down of God knows how many years ago. Um, and we've, we've just been waiting for this and it's just, yeah, it's just not good, okay? <laughs> Games are not releasing in a good state anymore. It's just, it just seems to be the way it is. I don't know why I pre-ordered this. I never usually pre-order. I think the last game I pre-ordered was Red Dead 2. I knew that was going to be good because it was Rockstar and I trust them. On another note, I haven't played single player yet, so I don't know how that is. A lot of people are saying single player is fine, apart from missing maybe some cutscenes and some audio problems. And not even the graphics aren't even that improved. Yeah, sure they're crisper, but um, it, just play the originals at this point. Or we'll wait for a sale. I don't know. It just it doesn't seem doesn't seem worth it in this current state. Hopefully they address the issue soon and fix it, and we get 
the Battlefront game we all rightly deserve because Battlefront has been it's, it's cursed. We was getting into a good point with Battlefront 2 EA's version and then they obviously they pulled support and we, we've just been left in the dark. Hopefully within the next week or so it's fixed I don't know apparently the developer has a very bad track record of actually updating their games and fixing stuff especially with the like the KOTOR switch releases and all that I did play a couple of matches of the space assault that seems to work pretty well apart from maybe the, the vehicles the invert I, I couldn't get used to the controls it took me a well it took me a long time to get used to them like near to the end of the match that was fun that worked fine I had no issues with that at all apart from the controls it's still fun going to the enemy ship and boarding it and blowing it up from the inside. I had a couple of guys with me who was helping me out. It was it was it was good. I enjoyed that very much. They just need there's a few things I need to fix really quickly, and then we'll be back to having a decent battlefront game because it's there. It's there. They haven't. They just haven't done much with it. And so I don't know how you break a 20 year old game at this point, <laughs> but they've done it. They've done it. Battlefront one works wonderful apart from a few control issues no lag whatsoever Battlefront 2 on the other hand yeah don't, don't even bother yet trying that one I suppose this video's turned kind of into a review more so than just a commentary video because again my recording got corrupted so a bit a bit of different content for the channel I suppose but yeah anyway thanks for watching my two Battlefront videos I'll definitely do some single player content videos on the classic collection soon. Not sure when, but I, I want to play through the Galactic Conquest at some point. Maybe I'll do a full playthrough on the channel. We shall see. But yeah, thanks for watching and uh, we'll see you in my next video. Peace out.